Alright guys, it is Monday and I am wanting to bust a myth, aka Mythbuster Monday. <laughs> I'm so dumb. <laughs> no, sorry. Um, yeah. Anyways, <laughs> I just know that there's so, I get so many questions in emails and with my clients and with just like friends because they know I'm into health and fitness. and. I just hear a ton of myths going around with like the whole health and fitness realm and people are like, oh, is this true? Or, oh, I'm gonna get fat if blah, blah, blah. Or, oh, I can't eat that. Or, oh, I can't do this. And so let's just break one myth today and then every Monday come back for another Mythbuster. But first, before we get to Mythbuster Monday, just wanna let you guys know, I do put out new videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday morning around 8.30. Eastern time, so make sure you're tuning in every Monday, Wednesday, Friday morning. But now let's get back to our Mythbuster Monday. Today we are just going to talk about does eating fat make you fat? All right guys, so many people are stuck on these low fat diets or like I can't eat anything, I'm going to buy fat free everything. And there's a couple things that like I do like to buy like low fat or fat free and whatever, like it's okay. But I'm just saying like fat is not going to make you fat. I promise you that. Like when it comes to gaining weight or losing weight, it's all about calories in versus calories out. So whether that's extra calories you're getting in through protein, fats, or carbs, if you get extra calories in, then you burn that. That is what is going to lead to extra energy intake, which is going to end up in extra fat. And so whatever your body isn't burning and isn't needing for like muscular like activity and you're just your body's work, that is what gets stored as fat. And so eating like nuts or peanut butter or any kind of fat doesn't make you fat. It's extra calories in total that your body doesn't use up because then it puts it into the stores. So, going along with that, Mythbuster broken. Fat does not make you fat, guys. Don't fear the fat. Don't FF. Don't F, don't fear the fat. Don't, I'm trying to come up with something catchy, but it's not really working. So, if you're given the option to, I don't know, have some real peanut butter versus PB2, don't get me wrong, I like PB2 as well, but don't be like, ah, I have to choose PB2 because honestly, I eat a lot more PB2 than I would real peanut butter just because it's not as filling. Fat really does lead to feeling full a lot quicker than eating carbs does. And so even though PB2 is lower in fat and total calories than real peanut butter, I usually eat a lot less peanut butter than PB2. So in just that example, like say you're only gonna have like one to two tablespoons of real peanut butter or you're gonna end up binge eating on like a cup of PB2 because it's just not really satisfying you, the better and healthier option for you is going to be the real peanut butter. So just keep that in mind and don't let your mind give you these fear foods of anything just because it's high in fat because fat does not make you fat. All right, hope you guys liked this video. In the comments below, let me know what next question or myth you want me to answer here. And yeah, I'll let you know, fact or fiction Monday. <laughs> so in the comments below, let me know what you think might be true, might not be true. I will do my research, not just Google search and come to the first answer I come to. I actually do research on these things, slash I'm a nutrition major and now I'm getting my master's in sports nutrition so I have a lot of stuff up here or at least I'd like to think so. So comment below, click the thumbs up if you like this video and subscribe if you aren't already. Love you guys all and really, really, really do love all the support you give me so thank you so much for that and until next time, bye. And 
I just wanted to do a short video on the top 10 foods that I've been loving lately because the last time I made a video like this, you guys really liked it. And so I'm gonna do new foods, even though the other foods I said last time are still foods I love. Um, like, uh, I don't know, Quest Bars and um, 